Welcome back to my channel guys. Today we're gonna do some Coach Create. We're also gonna do a Come Shop With Me. I'll probably do this in two parts video, so you guys will see me wearing the same thing. Don't come for me, but stick around and let's get started. All right, so we're starting with our Amazon Green Mini Cash In. It was fully wrapped. They pulled it from the back for me. Here's some of the made to order options, but those pins in front you see are the ones that I've selected. These are all the ones that you get to pick from. And they also have tea roses and patches. And first you select what you do like and what would you like on the bag. Here's my bag of the day, my field tote. Love this bag, so many compliments. And then he helped me with placing because I'm not too good uh, with that. And they also do studs and whatnot to fill in the background. And this is uh, more or less of the placement that I chose. He helped me with. He, Fabian was amazing. We got the Rexy. We got the Bear. Here's the pins. Here's the tea roses and the patches that they can customize your bag with. Also with the hang tags. And those are for the Tabby 26, the little C's on there. And you have all the rainbow colors of the hang tags you can customize with along with the foils. And after you've made your selections, they take you on over to the register. They ring you up for all the pins, all the studs, patches, tea roses, whatever that you're going to use to customize your item. They ring you up. They ring you up for the item. And you guys keep in mind, if you're a coach insider, which you can sign up online for free, you get up to $125 worth of customization for free with any bag purchase they used to have a minimum amount but they got rid of that so I believe you get two per year and it's up to $125 each time so that's exactly what I did here and you guys that's a lot of customization that took care of almost everything that I picked out including the all the extra studs that I needed I think I only had to pay like $40 maybe out of my pocket to get all that customization done I was curious about getting some patches put on, but unfortunately the patches, they are beautiful, but they are quite large. So it wasn't a really good fit for my mini cash in. So I just stuck with uh, the pins and the studs just to fill in the kind of like the negative space in that area. So I really wanted to go crazy with this. I told them like the more the merrier, the more that we can fit on there. But like I told you guys, it's kind of difficult on the mini cash in since there is a credit card uh, pouch in the front and there also is a story patch on the back. So it does make it a little bit more difficult. They normally don't try to get anything where the pockets and whatnot, but he was amazing and he tried to fit as much as he possibly could in there and try to work around certain areas without it making uh, look a little too weird with negative space and so if you guys are enjoying this i'm just going to do a time lapse of the whole process stick around towards the middle of the video i'm going to show you guys the made to order options that they have as far as the leathers the colors and just uh, different ways that you can customize your bags with coach create All right, so as you guys can see here, after they punch out those holes in the bags, they have to line the pins up and there's these little screw backs that have to go in, uh, inside to the back of them. The pins usually have two screws to them and the studs have one. So you'll see him trying to get in there and try to perfectly tighten each and every one of the screws. He got the majority of all the big pins done here. And of course I had to come back and be extra and say, hey, do you think you can add one of those studs to the clasps there just to, you know, 
me be extra on extra and he was so sweet he was saying absolutely we'll go ahead and get that taken care of so he went ahead and did that for me and now he's going back after he's put in those pins and he's figuring out where he wants to put these studs for the uh, to fill all the negative space those I believe also have a screw back on it so it's not the quickest job but once it's on there it's on there pretty good and the outcome came out pretty amazing here's some of the hot stamping that they can do they have amazing range of characters taxi cabs donuts food whatever you want chances are they have it and this is the made to order rogue that i fell in love with it's ostrich trim they no longer offer that or with the clochette it is for sale so if it's something you're interested in go ahead and give them a call here's some swatches of all the different leathers that you'll be seeing that you can have done on your made to order rogue stick around to the end of the video and i'll insert some more uh, leather swatches a little bit clearer that you guys can see and actually uh, see the color difference between each one of them here's some of the handle options that they have this is a mixture of the original um, glove tan leather and some of the uh, natural leathers that they have that one's turmeric root right there you have carmine in the front And got some more colors here that's looking like dark denim and olive, heather gray, chalk, and of course classic black. And here's some more of the natural leathers up here. That carrot right there you see, that one was my favorite. It's really pretty in person, a little bit more orange in person. Some of the hang tags, and I really love that they gives you a visual of when you're building your made-to-order rogue that you can touch and feel, even the hardware colors here. This is like a giant adult fidget spinner. I wish I could have taken one of these home. They were so heavy and they were so satisfying to click open and close. He's all done with the front there. He was just getting my approval on the front. Now he's moved over to the back. And I really love the extra care that he took in making my customization happen. As you can see, like the dust bag is right there on the table since the front already has pins all over it. He just wanted to make sure that they weren't gonna get scratched up, dinged up. And I really love that he did that because I can be a little crazy sometimes with my bags. You guys can't hear it, but he's hitting that thing really, really hard with that hammer because you got to think, you got to get through all the leather, you got to get through the lining of the bag. And this mini cash has that 1941 canvas interior. So he's got to get through both layers. When, if you're in person and you're seeing this being done, the noise is pretty loud. You hear it 
throughout the store, but I mean, it's for a good reason. It comes out amazing. Here's a little bit more of a close up of all the hot stamping you guys can have done on your hang tags. I highly recommend coming in store if you can, but if not, I hope this video helps you guys see all the different hot stampings that they can do. There's so many cute ones, there's seasonal ones, there's uh, hashtags, there's taxi cabs, guitars, just about anything that you can think of, they do have it. This display here was about 10 feet tall at least, you guys. It was huge, so you'll see towards the end. It was kind of hard for me to get all the way to the top, but there's so many. I hope you guys have fun making these. All right, here we have swatches of all the new original leathers. We have original natural leather and carbon powder. We have original natural leather and plant green. You guys know I have a bag in the plant green. It actually looks darker in store. The plant green one that I have is a lot lighter than that. Original natural leather in the carmine. This is glove tan in the chalk. The natural leather in the tumic root. The natural leather in the bright carmine. The natural leather in nutshell natural leather and red fruits and then my personal favorite the natural leather and carrot I love that I'm still curious about the carmine situation if you guys remember from my previous videos carmine is usually made with beetles that are crushed up so I don't know if that's where they get the red color for the carmine and the bright carmine but Right, you guys, and this is the original, um, the glove tan pebbled leather. Everybody's favorite ginger. Everybody loves that color. You have ox blood, heather gray, rouge, hay, olive, chalk, dark denim, classic black and 1941 saddle. All right, you guys, lastly is the smooth glove cam leather. This is ox blood here. There's the rouge, ginger, black, 1941 saddle, heather gray, olive, dark denim, and there's hay again. All right, he's just putting on the finishing touches there on the back, and then he's gonna move on lastly to that little extra stud that I did request. He was so amazing in getting everything done on that bag that I did request. And after that, he's gonna hit it with some Coach Moisturizer just to get it all shined up, a little extra, and then he's gonna bag it up for me, box it up, and get me on my way. Thank you so much to South Coast Plaza Coach. You guys were amazing to work with. The staff is so friendly. If you guys want any of your bags customized, they will take care of it for you and do it so amazingly. I highly recommend you guys giving this a try because look how cute that came out, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope you'll enjoy the unboxing that we're gonna have soon. All right, you guys, we've secured the bag. We got our first Coach Create bag, uh, the mini cash in. I'm super excited. The staff here at South Coast Plaza Coach couldn't have been nicer. They were so accommodating. They let me film. It's been amazing. If you guys need anything from the store, I'll link them in the description. You guys can give them a call. They will be more than willing to help you guys out. I'm super excited for this. My first Coach Create piece and look at the bag. I love it. So I'm going to get this all in box for you guys and show you guys around and see exactly how Coach Create works.